In the last four years, we have planted 21,786 trees in three countries, Greenland, Tajikistan, and Denmark, in a scientist-led charity to draw down atmospheric CO2 into diverse new forests, to increase bird habitat, to recharge CO2 and the microbial environment of degraded soils, to give young people a sustained environmental connection, and to do so with full transparency through our reporting and photo geo database. We work in Greenland when already there for work on ice, maintaining climate monitoring stations for the Danish government. We also work in Tajikistan and Denmark where the carbon uptake is much higher. In all locations, our work is specifically designed for what may be the most important activity we do, inspiring young people. Scores of young people each planting their own trees, their name on a metal tag that they hang on the tree, connecting them with their own trees, connecting them with nature, and giving them a memory to contemplate their entire lives. A tree to return to, to climb, and perhaps one day to show their own children. Now with our Greenland greenhouse running to propagate seeds and cuttings, we have halved the cost per tree to under $2. Now let me take you on a tour of our three locations and a new documentary film that we are co-producing that supplements the Greenland Trees outreach already featured in the award-winning film into the ice. In Greenland for 2023, we plan to continue transplanting hundreds of three to ten year old trees into a fenced plantation with participation of two schools. The kids have field days and become connected with the land and nature. Our other big plan for 2023 is to establish a tiny forest of 500 trees in the South Greenland settlement of Narsak, again with the engagement of local schools. In Tajikistan, we plan to continue planting in shelter belts along the borders of farmland. The shelter belts reduce evaporation and wind stress on crops and livestock. Today is the 7th of December, 2022. We're back here in Hulagorn, Denmark, and we just planted 70 trees, including 50 oaks and 20 fir trees. In addition to these uh, 27 fruit and nut trees that we planted about two weeks ago. In a new Denmark wing of our work, we have begun planting in a new regenerative agriculture conservation preserve. Here, in addition to high carbon uptake, the plants will serve nature and future generations by providing food from fruit and nut trees, sustainably harvest fencing and building materials, and the same farmland benefits as in Tajikistan. Our goal for 2023 is 12,000 new trees, enabling an eventual CO2 drawdown for 2023 planting alone of 800 tons, equivalent with 275 New York to London round trip flights. Join us and your trees will stand beside ours, capturing carbon for decades to come, dulling the edge of climate disruption and enabling ecological regeneration. Help us make it happen by contributing at tax deductible sites linked below.